Hi everyone, Michael Brown with you again. Welcome back to Educator.com's Adobe Photoshop CS6 course. In this particular lesson, we're still dealing with exposure and color. I'm going to show you a couple of nice, neat features in Photoshop. Colorize and black and white conversion. There are actually three ways to convert to black and white. And colorize is how to change color of an object or objects in your image. So let's get started. We'll talk about colorize first. Let me go to this image, which I already did this, so I really want to go back here. All right, I'm going to flatten this image out so that we can just get right to it. All right, here I've got this shot I took of a red Mercedes at a dealership. Let's say the client likes the shot except they go, you know, we didn't want the car red, we want it another color. Can you change the color? And everybody goes, oh yeah, sure. Your normal thought is that's very easy to do. We just select the sheet metal, which is a particular channel that I've already made. A selection isolates that area, and there it is. And so now I have a selection of the sheet metal, and so you go normally, all right, we'll just take the hue saturation control and we'll change the hue, which is the color reel. So let's give it a try. I could go to the image adjustments down to hue saturation, but I'm going to do it as an adjustment layer so that you can see it and we can alter it if necessary. Here's the same control under here that resides up here. The difference here is if I take these controls, it works directly on the pixels and I can't go back and show it to you. Where over here, it preserves it as an individual layer that can always be changed. There's the hue saturation, same control box. So we have, and if you look up here, you can see a tiny little thumbnail that has the isolation of just the sheet metal. So you go, fine, I'll just change the hue and you go like this and all of a sudden you go wait 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 a minute what happened here I've got yellow at the top of the car yellow green down here some of a green tone here we've got uh, purple working down the side here what happened well let's take a closer look from the very beginning 